Nigerians are currently stranded on the journey from Khartoum to Cairo after the drivers of the buses paid to evacuate them. Complain that the fuel finished and that the federal government has not remunerated them for the service. As of the time of filing this report, our correspondents guarded that none of the embassy officials are on ground to explain to stranded Nigerians, especially the students, why the drivers have stopped the buses over their claim. Before we started this journey, we have to go ourselves fighting. Can you even imagine that we are stuck in this desert for four and for five hours? How can we get we out? And we don't know the situation we are. We don't have what our money has finished. Can you even imagine? And they said they 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 buy they are not moving their bus. They said they are not moving their bus because they don't give them money. We never have to do this one. Look at this one. We don't even have compass. We don't know the desert. We don't know the desert. We don't know the desert. Evacuation is poorly equipped, poorly organized, and the students are here stranded for the past four days. There is no access to food, no access to clean water, no electricity, nothing. And uh, even just as we're sitting here, almost everywhere you can hear gunshots. We are not safe. Most of the ladies here, like, we spent days without taking baths. Yeah. No enough bathroom, no enough water, no water, no water. nothing no water at all, nothing, nothing. nothing. Like, we Muslims, look at it, like, no, we have to walk no very, very far to fetch this water to perform ablution. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.